Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wives 4E channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. On this episode of Sister Wives, Cody Brown showed optimism about mending his relationship with kids Gabrielle and Garrison Brown, despite a difficult few weeks. During the show, he broke down in tears and admitted, I'm pretty sad that I'm not close anymore. In the first episode of the season, Janelle acknowledged that she and Cody couldn't be together if he was estranged from his sons. I haven't been in touch with my Gabrielle or Garrison in quite a while, confessed Cody as an old photo of him with his sons Garrison and Gabrielle appeared on the screen. The fact that we are no longer close saddens me. Together, we have so many amazing experiences in our life. I have faith and hope that we will simply move past this in due course, and being in each other's vicinity again will be secure. There's not exactly an open door between Gabe and Garrison at the moment. They're not particularly interested in talking to me. According to the US Sun, Garrison and Gabrielle have struggled to stay in contact with their father after COVID struck. Last season, Cody accused his sons of disrespecting him and his fourth wife, Robin Brown, due to his strict COVID-19 rules, which caused his relationship with them to deteriorate. Cody's need for an apology from the kids at the time for their actions caused more rifts between them. Consequently, Cody and Robin were not with Janelle and her six kids for the holidays in 2021. In the Sunday Sister Wives episode, Cody also made his first visit to his ex-wife Janelle and their daughter Savannah at their new home. He didn't feel at home at Janelle's new place, no matter how big it was. He reportedly said, I like this place, as reported by people. The second unit was somewhat small. However, it suddenly occurred to me that perhaps Janelle moved here since our apartment was the previous one. She moved here, therefore I don't think I'll be living here with her anymore, even though I was living there with her. The father went on, that's her apartment. It is not owned by us. However, there isn't place for me. It is not between her and me. The only reason she's showing me, to be honest, is because our daughter Savannah lives there. This apartment catches my attention. I mean, it seems so clear to me. I will never make it my home. Cody continued speaking to the cameras, saying, I once asked Janelle, say, what is it? How come we can't get along? Let's attempt to make amends. How come we can't? She remarked. Well, I'm just not interested in becoming involved with Robin and Mary. I don't know what your relationship with them is. We made a deal regarding plural marriage, therefore that's unfortunate. But Janelle had another story to share. She stated in the confessional but he's never told me, hey, I love you. You are missed. I want to reconcile with you. It's always the same. Wouldn't it be nice to reunite the family so that everything can return to normal in his life? Following Garrison and I really Brown's passing in early March 2024, Sister Wives followers have grown more concerned for Gabrielle, his younger brother. Regretfully, it was Gabe who found Garrison's body following his death out of family. Because of how close the brothers were, people were concerned about Gabe's general well-being and mental health. Janelle Brown has been very committed and active in her children's life in the weeks after Garrison's passing. She stayed with Maddie Brown Brush's family in North Carolina before she went to view the eclipse with Logan and Michelle. She has since given a lovely update about Gabe. See what Janelle had to say by continuing to read. Janelle Brown prepares a banquet for her children. The process of losing a family member is never easy. However, given all the drama that occurred on television in the previous season, Sister Wise fans surmise that the Browns were greatly affected by Garrison's passing. It's no secret that Cody Brown and Garrison, Gabrielle, and a few other kids didn't get along. Supporters hope Garrison's siblings are doing well and are concerned about them. Things are beginning to pick up around Janelle's house once more, she claims. She revealed that she had prepared a handmade dinner for the kids on her Instagram stories. Gabe obviously has a rather large appetite, and they are both enjoying their time together. She wrote, trying to cook a little for my Flagstaff kids, as the picture's description. Gabe said he would eat a whole cheeseburger pizza by himself when I mentioned it. 
The news that Gabe is eating healthily and spending time with his mother has thrilled Janelle's fans. The TLC star hosts a Thanksgiving dinner with her family April. People are happy to observe that Gabrielle seems to be in a better mood. And since his brother's untimely death, Janelle claims that Gabe has done other enjoyable and unforgettable things. Janelle disclosed earlier this week that they had a Thanksgiving meal in April. This week, I'm back in Flagstaff, because one of the group is an international student at NAU who has never attended a Thanksgiving and will be returning home at the end of the semester. Gabe's pals hosted a Friendsgiving today, Janelle posted on Instagram. A picture of Gabrielle and his buddies sitting around a table full of delectable food was attached by her. I didn't cook. Instead, I got to savor the dinner. It was enjoyable. Thanks to Elle, we were able to try some Australian food, like lamingtons and sausage buns. Do you think it's great that Gabe Brown is getting back to enjoying life and spending more time with Janelle? Post your ideas and opinions in the comments section. Get the most recent updates about Sister Wives by following TV shows Ace Online to stay up to date with the Brown family. Days after Garrison Return Brown's shortly. unexpected death, his parents are still in mourning. On Tuesday, March 5, Sister Wives actresses Janelle and Cody Brown lost their son Garrison, apparently by suicide. Following the shocking announcement, the Sister Wives community has shown the Browns an overwhelming amount of support from friends, family, and fans of Janelle hasn't said anything about Garrison's passing up until now, with the exception of an Instagram statement. Janelle has shared a wonderful experience over three months after pulling all of her kids together, which is quite an accomplishment, including herself and all six of her children, Logan, Madison, Hunter, Garrison, Gabrielle, and Savannah, as well as their significant others and Janelle's two grandchildren, Axel and Evie, the mother of six released a family portrait this week that was taken at Christmas 2023. The 13 members of the group smile for the camera as they posed among the trees and grass in the outdoor picture. Janelle started the post with, Last Christmas, I spent time with all of my children. It was incredible, because juggling time like this in everyone's hectic lives is difficult, she added. Now that we have photos, I'm so appreciative. Though Janelle removed comments from the post, it received hundreds of thousands of likes. For the first time since Garrison's passing, Christine Brown, another of his mothers, also spoke up. Christine raised Garrison, even though she is not his real mother, and she is very close to all of Janelle's kids. In the backyard of her previous Flagstaff, Arizona home, Christine posted a short footage showing Garrison creating a garden bed for his younger sister, Truly. He completed the task in just 23 minutes. During the height of the coronavirus outbreak, Garrison decided to add a little something extra to Truly's quarantined birthday, and that's how the video ended up on a Sister Wives episode. Christine added a heartfelt commentary to the video, but she also sped it up and removed the sound. Garrison was a nice, kind brother who made truly a flower of it since he recognized that she needed a hobby. We'll always miss him, she captioned the photo, using the hashtags hashtag love you, hashtag gratitude, hashtag miss you, and hashtag telfos you Thousands of Instagram users left their sympathies in the comments area after seeing Christine's post, which received hundreds of thousands of likes. Since his departure, Several others have paid their respects to Garrison, including Kati Charlene, the daughter of Christine Woolley's husband, David Woolley. In order to show her sympathy, Katie included two red heart emojis atop a screenshot she took of Janelle announcing Garrison's passing in her Instagram story. A screenshot from Garrison's Instagram feed was shared by his sister, Gwendolyn, to announce his passing. Robert, also known as Garrison, our cherished brother slash son, died away late last night. We are grateful to everyone who has shown us love and support, the post said. We kindly request that during this difficult time, everyone respect our space and privacy. Additionally, Mary Brown, Garrison's other mother, was among the first Browns to speak out after Garrison's death, as monsters and critics previously documented. 
We are very sorry to inform you of the passing of Robert Garrison Brown, our lovely son. In a description that accompanied two images of Garrison, Mary said, he was a bright spot in the lives of all who knew him. It is unbelievable how much of a hole this loss will create in our lives. Please join us in paying tribute to his memory at this time and respect our privacy. We adore you and will miss you, Garrison. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.